Hey guys, welcome to our review of Kamen Rider Geo episode 13. As always, I'm your host, Frozen Stratos. Here with me today we have... Interplace. My dude, welcome back. Uh, and yeah, we just got done watching this episode and it was absolutely fantastic. Um, I And I'd, I'd wager this is... Um, Ghost done right? Or at least done well? Yeah, yep. relatively well. Relatively like... well. Yeah, like with all his other appearances in his own show, this is easily the best I've seen him. Not intrusive, not annoying, but like me, like you know, actually helping people. And they're you, they've got creative ways of using his powers. Like he still has powers outside of his suit, and that would be like talking to the dead and doing spiritual stuff because that's what his dad taught him. So I really like that. that kept going, you know? Um, just like how with Eiji, he didn't become a writer, so he became a politician, and uh, so many other writers had that sort of different fate, you know, what their fates would have been like had writer not been part of their lives. Uh, so I definitely like to see that, you know, he was still him. Yeah, and honestly, one of the biggest surprises for this episode for me, on the ghost side of things, was this two, I don't want to call them stooges, but like, I kind of want to. The other two <laughs> priests at the uh, temple also returned for an yeah. appearance. One of them holding a grabby thingy for some reason. <laughs> I... <laughs> yeah, their method of like capturing monsters and kidnapping people could use a little, little bit of work, but you know yeah. what? If all they're doing is capturing Sogo, who's probably one of the most complacent people on the fucking planet, <laughs> it's just, it, it did its job. Yeah. yeah. Um... And Ghost was like. What I liked about him it was, like, he was relevant enough. Like, one of our complaints for, like, last week's episode was that Kaito and um, Gaim weren't really doing as much as they sh could have been doing because, like, they're such strong characters. And, like, what they could, like, actually provide for the episode would be, like, so much more... would be a lot greater. Yeah, like, and, like, the way that they... that they were able to... Because, like, his setting is basically the same as it would be in his regular show, you know, except he just doesn't have the ghost powers. And yeah. you really get to see him just go through the motions of his job. And it made for just a better time with the character again. Because you saw him mostly as he was. Um, yeah. And just, he, he was basically doing... a. Uh, 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 villain of the week thing with this person, you know? Yeah, it was like a crossover yeah. more than, you know? <laughs> yeah, very much so. And, like, even people were were all about Decade and saying that, or not saying, but, like, you know, they, most people were excited for Decade and him coming back and all that stuff, but really Ghost did a lot more in terms of, like, being a returning character. Well, I mean, Decade was consistent with his character. It's just they downplayed him and they gave Ghost enough room. And, like, from the looks of the preview, it looks to be an even more impressive Ghost story, hopefully. Yeah, if Spectre's coming back, man, holy shit. <laughs> I know. And the thing is, like, these past few riders, we haven't seen them transform at all. And that's really one of the major draws for doing uh sort of crossover anniversary sort of stuff and the fact that it's missing in some of it and it being a rare thing it's nice to see again yeah and I like wish geo okay geo and fucking gays transform three times an episode <laughs> like and we can't have <laughs> the other writer just transform once like i know um, right they they have the assets i know that they're still sitting there on some sort of hard drive just use them yeah. but um Oh, you know what? Maybe they just can't get them back for ADR. I don't know. Who knows? But uh, I did really like... Um... You know what? Let, let, me talk, let me talk about what I didn't like. Anything that Gates did. Because <laughs> it was just so wildly inconsistent. First yeah. he's like at his throat. The next he's mourning his death. I, I, yeah, I and I kind of like understand. 
like a lot of the I like I really like ghosts in this episode and I see like one of the things that they did to kind of make ghost character ghost character look better was to have gays do something stupid like kill the dude and make him look <laughs> really bad. I mean like honestly well, yeah, that it, was that was really interesting. If they kept with that for a while, I wouldn't have been too mad about it. I would have loved that. Yeah, like they were kind of pissed off like he knew he fucked up and like for gays perspective on things like that was like the most logical thing to do like he didn't expect like that outcome to actually happen yeah um I, and like as you said i kind of wish that they kind of stuck with that a little bit more and instead of like decade just kind of shifting the focus entirely yeah. and then but yeah aside from that like i appreciate him kind of doing something useful for like ghost kind of like villain of the week story type type of thing yeah you know yeah. He's like the investigator and like, oh shit, something happened. You know, if we kind of like go back in time to like a ghost episode, this would be a pretty neat thing that would happen. Yeah. yeah. And like it. Yeah, it's it's really cool. Just sort of like how this episode, it, it had geo elements, but really it was just jumping into a ghost episode. Yeah. And but... the inciting incident was geo's sort of like story, but it's really a ghost episode. Yeah, but do we want to go back to gays for a little bit? A little yeah, bit more, a little bit of more roasting. The gorilla man himself. I don't know yeah. why that juxtaposition was there. It was probably because like they shot <laughs> the scene where he jump kicked Geo pretty early, and just like that dude looks like a fucking monkey. <laughs> but, like, they had to find a place specifically that had that huge gorilla. Why? <laughs> It's probably on the commute to work, but they finally found a reason to use it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was that was quite ridiculous. I don't yeah. know why Gaze waited until like the morning to actually like kill Geo. Right. Or... And like, it... what if what if it wasn't just the morning? What if this is just a few days later? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just woke up one day, just like you know what, fuck that dude, I'm killing him. <laughs> yeah, today's the day. <laughs> like. <laughs> Like, no joke, he, like, tossed them, like, down the stairs. That was yeah. a bit like... You know, maybe he's just a bully. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, I don't know, man. This... It's, so like, when it's... they're doing this guy, he's supposed to be, like, reluctantly on Geo's side, you know? But, like, I, I don't see the reluctance outside of, like, maybe spite and, like, not wanting that potential future like if you tell someone to do something they automatically don't want to do it it feels like he's operating with that mentality but he has loftier goals and he like reaffirmed his connection to those goals last episode with kaito and it just ultimately landed (laughs) nowhere no we didn't (laughs) (laughs) Like, him reaffirming his vengeance, like, that made no sense in that episode. And here it kind of shows how shitty it is. Like, especially, like, when he hands Geo the ghost power-up to fight uh, yeah! the thing. Like, if he has it, why doesn't he use it himself and fix it himself? Right? <laughs> that, like, that was uh, from, I mean, from the standpoint of you should be hating him. Yeah, don't give it to him. But also, like, why don't you handle it yourself? What... What makes the the wizard armor so much more effective than Ghost or Gaim, for that matter? Yeah. I don't know. And, hey, speaking of Gaim, last episode, we had a second Geo. And he just sort of, oh, I don't know, disappeared? Yeah. There you go! Did we did we not get an explanation for that? Maybe it's in the point fives. As of this recording, the point five hasn't come out, so you you know it won't stop people in the comments grilling us for not knowing or like not having experienced the point fives. But it, I where where is he? What is he up to? Yeah, I feel like that's gonna be their cop out for Omegio at the very end. You know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I have a feeling the point five will say something about it. Because they've yeah. been pretty self-aware recently. So I'm I'm hoping. But yeah. Also, I'm kind of interested in, like, Decay's relationship with the Time Jackers. Because, like, 
they all kind of time travel, so like it's kind of funny that they're acquaintances somehow. <laughs> like the way that Waz was well, kind of talking about him earlier on. Decade dimension travels. Then he merged the worlds of the different common writers together, so I guess he time traveled. But whatever. I think they're gonna do a dumb thing, pull a fast one, and he'll be like, "Hey, yeah, I somehow." through undermining your guys' plan, was able to revive the guy that is another ghost. There you go. Hold on. Yeah, it's like, while you guys were, like, bitching and doing all your regular toku shit, you know what? I just, I just fucked up the plot in the background, but don't... You know. Yeah. <laughs> but whatever. Hey, also, uh, we got a glimpse of Decade's new uh, belt, which has... All 20 Heisei Riders instead of 10. Um, and that is why uh, I went through my archive of so- Shoto figures and brought out my extra decade. I'm going to be painting this guy's belt pink. That is the only reason. Well, also, I wanted to eat the candy because they switched the stupid Soto candy back to gum. They're not back to gum, into gum. Now the candy's gone, but whatever, whatever. I'm not mad. I'm not salty. I'm sweet because I have all It'll this candy. It'll be fun though if you just became a reoccurring character <laughs> and prohibited <laughs> like uh, Geo and Gaze from henching into like the prior riders who's just like gating it all. <laughs> I would love to see him like as a recurring character, but I'm pretty sure he's on Jenga, the other show that's on overtime. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> yeah. I like I'm I really want to see more out of this character and I wish I he got his own focus episode. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's but like just... him being a badass and styling on Gaze, you know, that's one thing I really liked about this. Like his appearance. <laughs> but, like Gaze pissing me off so much, like the way he just kinda of, like styled on him was just it was real nice to see. Yeah. I mean <laughs> like, like super it's... speed like <laughs> runs into this <laughs> kid. <laughs> I, like, I'm surprised uh, we didn't get, like, uh, a redone scene where, like, uh, when he was fighting Kabuto in one of the early uh, uh, decade episodes, um, they all clocked up and went super fast, and and Decade oh, was shit. like, well, I don't have uh, Kabuto for some reason because I haven't activated that card yet or whatever. Uh, but I do have Fies, and he can at least, you know, keep up with you guys for 10 seconds. So I thought he'd pull out something similar like that, but he decided to stay as just regular-ass ground form uh, Agito, so... You know, I, I half expected him to pull out, like, a drive card in show how it's supposed to be used. <laughs> 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 like, punch your mind the pride. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh this episode does give us that prospect of being able to see drive because initially when the show started he just sort of showed up with drive and and ghost and we thought oh hey maybe he collected those earlier turns out those are future ride watches and i know that dawson uh theorized that earlier so i'm glad to see that that's true and we can actually go back and see tomari and maybe he's with kiriko and they've got uh their kid or maybe it's in a world where they didn't actually have to you know meet because uh cream steinbelt never would have recruited recruited kiriko or drive you know what a fucking age he comes back from the fucking past <laughs> 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 Oh man, the possibilities are like fucking everywhere. No, I like I'm just really happy to have maybe drive back. And also mock? Could we get mock? Oh I, I, I need mean, a boy. I mean, we're getting stuck next episode. We yeah, totally but, <sighs> but honestly, what we're probably gonna get is like maybe drives returning actor and then I don't know, the tech guy. No, nah, here's one they do. It's gonna be like a kind of, as a different writer. I need to go to the police station, and uh, he's gonna be there. And he's like, "Oh, someone dropped this. Is this yours?" I'm like, "Oh, the fucking drive, little fucking." <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Yeah. But, yeah. So, I don't want to keep my expectations yeah. high, even yeah. though. But, oh. I, I'm wondering who directed this because it seems like they at least have more of a handle on what Ryder is like than the last few episodes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm. I'm. I, I'll look that up after this. But guys, this has gone way too long. Guys, thanks for watching. If you like this episode, hit that like button and subscribe if you want to hear more from us each week. And um, we we said this in the uh, watch along that came out alongside this, but we've got a new format here. We are able to make this work. And again, I want to give a huge shout out to you, Bell Mastery, who uh, gave us feedback on the last time we used this format. We asked you guys if you wanted to see this more. Um, and he told us this format is much better being able to see you all at the same time. So, you know what? For you, thank you so much for your feedback. We really appreciate it. And um, we found a way to make this uh, format way more sustainable. So you'll be seeing this across most of our stuff. You didn't see it with Gridman because we had to do some other funky stuff, but you're seeing it now. And I think it'll be like a thing that we will have for now and until we I guess do another big format change and we might even make some improvements to this as well but yeah anyways thank you so much and guys if you if you want a shout out just leave some feedback in the comments down below and we'll shout you out too um hopefully i don't know i mean it, it depends on how many of you do it but there aren't many of you so <laughs> just get to it guys thanks for watching keep it juicy see you that got rambly I saw you. I saw you like rolling your eyes. You realize they can see you now too, right? Oh yeah. It doesn't, yeah. Up. Okay. <laughs> Cause it don't switch no more. <clears throat> yeah, you know, I'm.